So another evolution once again, growth spurt. And I'm excited by this one. I'm seeing a 75 rated go all the way to an 88. And the best thing about this at first glance, the evolution is completely free. For cheap and fast FC24 Ultimate Team Coins, head over to MMOEXP.com, link down below, and make sure to use my code Morsi at checkout to get yourself 5% off. So let's see if we've got anyone kicking about in the club. Uh, before we do it, the max overall is 75. So it's more catered towards silvers. And of course, 75 rated golds, which I'm a fan of. I'm getting flashbacks to, what was it called? What was the Kobe Mino one? I can't remember. Golden Glow Up, that was it. The first evolution that we were hoping we're going to get more similar to, but it just never came. Hopefully this is it. Growth Spurt, max 76 pace, course max overall 75, dribbling max 80, physical max 80, number of play styles 7, and games to get it done. Doesn't look too bad, considering the size of the upgrade. And they've given us two. Are they the same? Okay, exactly the same, but you get... Okay, the playstyles changes in capital letters. I don't know if you see that next to Dead Ball. Um, you get Dead Ball playstyle plus as well. There's something to mention here, uh, which is nice. But do we have anyone in the club, really, that stands out? I'm thinking Silvers. I did buy Romeo Lavia on the other account, the RTG, uh, because I thought maybe he would be eligible. I tell you what, the best shout realistically is head straight to foot.gg and have a look over there because I'm not going to find much in this one, I don't think. So let's load up that little tab. While I'm doing that, you know that drill, smash that like button. It is Christmas tomorrow. I hope if you are, if you are celebrating your fantastic time, your friends and family. Uh, but yeah, we've got FIFA to look at here. The, the important stuff. Grow Sport 1 and 2 FC24 Evolution I am staring at right now. Let's turn off the um, the chains for now. And look at the standout players who you could do purely with this evolution. So Origi, hold up. Is, he's 75 rated, isn't he? So Origi, of course, being Nottingham Forest. Play styles aren't too shabby, but it looks a little bit below the power curve, especially with the pace split and the dribbling not being fantastic. But I guess if you're a Forest fan or just a fan of Origi in general, then maybe that is the way to go. By the way, some of these cards, like super high rated, should nowhere be near 88 rated. This man doesn't have a single stat over 82. Yeah, he's 88 rated, but it is what it is. I'm intrigued by, like, silver cards. That's kind of what I'm thinking here. We've got Bamford. We've got Cooney Cross in here as well. I think it might be a shot that had a foot bin at some point and see the cards that are trending to get an idea because I'm almost certain Romeo Lavia is going to be eligible for this because he is a silver. He has no stats over the required. Broha, another Chelsea boy. Jose Callahan. hold up. Is this the Jose Callahan of old at Napoli days? He looks so different in the photo. It could be a completely different bloke. And if it is, then fair play. But he doesn't look too shabby considering it's free. Definitely worth considering. Um, in regards to like chaining these Evos, as in like putting one in Gross Spurt 1 and then into Gross Spurt 2, I'm sure that's possible as well. Cantwell. Oh my days. At Rangers, four star, three star. Um, a little bit, yeah. Not, not anything crazy there. It's one of those where he's 88 rated with stats that probably like an 82 and 84 could have. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing too much realistically. Then Donker doesn't look too shabby, you know. Even though the pace is a little bit poor. Uh, what are we, 71 on the pace? The pace bit shocking. A little bit clunky, but as a box-to-box -box centre mid, Villa fans, if you're running like a Villa past and present, you could be onto something for that uh, for that one right there. Odson Edward. What are we, uh, we're four-star, four-star, okay. For some reason, I thought we had a five-star weak foot. High, medium. Decent-looking stats. Palace, of course, we've got Finesse shot in there, technical. He could be a shout. Dead ball play style plus. Does it give them like big uh, free kicks? To be fair, it's free kick accuracy is 91. I wonder if the evolution itself actually adds a lot in regards to the uh, that stat. I doubt it does, but maybe it does. I don't know. Because it'd be weird having a dead ball and then having absolutely shocking set piece uh, capabilities. Big Mohamed Al Nenny, of course, everybody's going to be doing that one. Big Mo in the building. Uh, we're basically looking for, for all round Hullet Gang kind of style cards here. The best two players we've seen so far have been. Hold up, Hammer? What are we saying? Gustavo Hammer. Only freestyle, freestyle, but 99 balance is pretty sick. Dribbling looks good. Great passing stats, good physicals, great defending. As a box to box centre mid, I've seen worse. Leagues aren't, well, league links aren't bad. Sheffield United is a bit of an issue, but Dutch, not bad whatsoever. He could be a, a little decent shout, you know. Um, definitely worth considering for sure. And he's a, a gold, gold common card, so I can't imagine him being super expensive. Uh, almost to look gank here for a man's name that I'm definitely not going to pronounce because I'll be butchering that for sure. Mateus Enrique. Syria looks pretty crazy. 
The shooting lets him down, same with the defending and physical, but as like a playmaker, I guess, you are very limited with the shooting being quite low, but the dribbling's nice, technical play style as well, three star, four star in the Serie A, not the worst option to go for. Uh, by the way, do let me know the card down below, the players that you're gonna be doing for this evolution, if you've got any crazy change you could do as well. By the looks of it, there are so many options here. Um, it's looking pretty crazy. Like so many different cards fit this criteria, which is fantastic. So maybe like chaining bronze cards is possible. What I'm gonna do actually is quickly load up Footbin, I think. Load up Footbin, have a little look, see if we can find anything. By the way, whenever I load up Footbin, this is always the page that shows up. What a legend this card was. Um, look at trending and we'll get a, a decent idea of a couple of cards here. So, Zera, oh yeah, of course. Yeah, Lavia, I did have a feeling he'll be there. He's almost gone extinct. So this man right now, Welcome to Evolutions, and he goes to an 88. Those stats are crazy. Absolutely crazy. Let's search him on foot.gg and have a little look um, in regards to Evolutions. Because we just want to do the gross spurt one or two. So just with one boost, this is the card we get. Almost to it gang. Shooting definitely lacking. But to be fair, the shot power position isn't half bad. Passing looks good. Dribbling very consistent. Pace is there. League links, of course. PSG, France, Ligue 1. Can't really go wrong. Um, he does have 62 free kick accuracy to partner his dead ball playstyle plus, so that's that. <laughs> Brilliant. Uh, free star, free star is not amazing, but he's definitely going to be one of the most popular for sure. And then I'm pretty certain Lavia was a card that we saw just there as well. He was the one that came to mind when I saw the elite requirements. So is he there? Oh, he is. Okay, yeah, now we're talking. We could chain it with like a rock as well. Oh, yes. That is a card. That is a card. Technical bruiser, but that's incisive pass. And then, of course, the playstyle plus. Shooting, absolutely not. As an out and out DM, we might be cooking something, though. Physicals look phenomenal. Defending stats 90 interceptions, 92 awareness, 91 stand tackle. Yeah, this man looks better than uh, the PSG lab we checked out a minute ago, for sure. And of course, you could chain Evos if you've not done like a rock yet, which I, I have not actually. So maybe I'll try and link them both together and get that done. Definitely a decent shout. That 88 rated us at the best, in my opinion. Any other ones on Footbin? Um, because I'm pretty certain Silvers are going to be what we're going to try and target for sure. Uh, all of these cards are eligible in the same ev evolution here. So Samari as well. Okay, he doesn't look too shabby. Of course, that's the championship though. That's the issue. Because championship cards, not too many really stand out to me. Um, where are I? Bubakari Samari. I swear he's actually moved. Isn't he at Seville? He definitely is. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I remember Arsenal playing against these guys. He's got to be here, I swear. Pace not too bad. Dribbling, I've seen better. The ball control is good with the reaction, dribbling composure, but agility balance letting him down. Bit more of a clunkier player for sure, but if you've got, you know, French links, La Liga, you could look to him to be uh, to be honest with you as a decent shout. I swear that Leicester card's more than likely extinct. I'm seeing Deli Ali and Vinicius, so those are the cards we're going to search next. Deli Ali, of course, does have a promo card for FC Pro. Um, so yeah, well, he's got an 88 rated, uh, which looks pretty crazy. But let's head over to this one. 7.5K, is his Evo ridiculous? Okay, yeah, it's pretty good. Wow. Four star, three star, Travella. Pace not amazing, but give him a to boost that up like a shadow. Use him as a box-to-box -box centimid. Going forward, we're gonna score goals with the shooting. The passing as well, brilliant. Dripping, yeah, I don't mind it. I know he's a little bit bigger, so maybe the Juliet balance is gonna be low, but it's not bad. Physicals are there. He looks like one of the best options for sure. And what was the other boy, Vinicius? Let's have a little look at your card. Deli Ali could be one of the ways to go if you can't get your hands on um, one of the uh, the silver cards, the uh, the PSG boy, or of course um, Romeo Lavia. Uh, are you part of this as well? You are. Okay. This, yeah. The stats is nothing crazy though. With the strikers, apart from Odson Edward, is lacking a little bit. Like this Vinicius doesn't look bad. But like the dribbling lets him down massively. Like he's going to feel a little bit slow. Same with the pace fit there. I think you're definitely going to struggle. So for me, it's 100% Lavia as the go-to because he looks absolutely phenomenal. Uh, other considerations, there might be some cool silver cards and some chains we could do as well. But at this stage while I'm recording, I can't really see anything. But in my opinion, this is the boy. Romeo Lavia, Premier League links, Belgium, Chelsea, strong connections there. The defending's just insane. As an out-and-out -out CDM, Play styles could be better, but Bruiser I like, Technical I like. Of course, Dead Ball's great with the free kick accuracy that we've got. Short passing's crazy as well. This could be a winner for me, 100%. Um, no, apart from that, nothing really stands out just before we looked at, but I'm sure there's some crazy chains. I mean, Edward wasn't bad. To be fair, 
Gustavo Hammer isn't too shabby either. And of course, if we head back to the console quickly, this man doesn't look too bad either. Stack here. Um, I'm pretty certain some famous content creator has been uh, singing this man's praises. I remember seeing him popping up. He looks pretty crazy and almost to let gang minus the shooting and Bundesliga links there. Tell you what, let me know down below any players that you found. Let's help each other out here. See if we can identify any hidden gems. I've been Morsi. I'll catch you guys later with another one. Take it easy.